Okay, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And this is going to be the energy monthly reading for the element of fire. And so there are four of these videos each month, one for each element. So please keep in mind that my tarot readings are for entertainment purposes only. There's a full disclaimer in the description box, so please remember to have a look at that. And we're still dealing with scammers in the tarot community. And if you're not familiar with that issue by now, there's more information in the description box about that as well, what to watch out for and things like that. So I'm just going to get right into it. So the message that I channeled, I did this ahead of time, um, rather than making the video longer, pulling cards uh, within the video. So what came through for fire energy here is... Um, we have the Knight of Cups, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Three of Swords for the main message. And the energy at the root of, of the message was the Three of Wands. So I'm just going to put that there. So what we have going on is um, a situation that you may have been through or that you may find yourself in. These, these messages that I channel are just um, things that we may need to know, situations we may find ourselves in, or situations that if we ever found ourselves in, that this is the perhaps the sort of um, insight we might need for coming from the tarot. So um, there's a situation where you went into it feeling sure and confident and positive about something you were doing, like a venture or a collaboration with somebody. Uh, only to be blindsided by total disappointment. So this left your self-trust uh, sort of feeling a bit unsure and shaky about that. Um, you're now unsure of your ability to make good decisions and to spot and discern good opportunities as opposed to maybe situations where you'd be taken advantage of. Um, so your your confidence has been shaken in that way. And so you're asking yourself, how did I not see this? I thought I was, I looked at everything so closely. How could I have been so wrong? And so we see this person here who thought they had a really, that they had made a really good assessment of what was going on, that they really saw things for what they were, that they had checked out every detail and that, um, you know, they knew what they were getting themselves into. And what was missing here is I think maybe you thought that you you were going in with a, that, that overview, that bird's eye view you had of everything was objective, was more objective than it was. You were actually going in more with this Knight of Cups energy, like with a heart on, wearing your heart on your sleeve, that kind of thing. And the Seven of Pentacles represents, I think, what you were expecting to get out of it. And I also got this sense that the person who invited you to participate in this opportunity, um, they knew that they were going to be getting a lot out of it, and they knew that you actually wouldn't be, but they, they invited you anyway because they needed your participation along with a couple of other people in order to get what they wanted out of it, which is interesting. Um, so with the Knight of Cups, you the reason you didn't see this, that this person was, you know, manipulating you, using you, is because you went in with that you didn't realize how much this was an emotion-based decision as opposed to a head or um, thinking-based decision. So what you did was you went all in and you got hurt, not just emotionally with that betrayal, but um, you lost out as well. Maybe your time was wasted, resources were wasted, things like that. And also, of course, you feel betrayed, which totally sucks and hurts. And so the Knight of Cups sort of rides in in good faith and ends up, we end up with the Three of Swords, which is, you know, this is um, where you feel backstabbed, where you feel hurt and used and manipulated hence the swords being the uh, swords represent the mind the intellect uh communication so you were lied to you were misled and so now you're asking yourself the real damage here at this point is that you're asking yourself how did i not see this and the message that's coming through for you is that it's important to realize that as a human being we are not always self-aware enough to realize 
how much our emotions are leading are leading us in decision making as opposed to actual thinking and logic and actually having a good you know i oh i did my research i really checked this out thoroughly and the the fact of the matter is you can do all that and still not realize how much your heart is actually leading the way or um, a deeply held wish that you have and i feel that this was something like that something that you really really wanted and so that's why you wanted so much for it to be true and for it to be real that that's why you were misled and i think this person knew that as well and the other thing i would say is you were not the only person that they misled i have a feeling there were two or three other people who got effed over in this process as well and they didn't really get what they wanted out of this either you didn't but this person who brought you all on board definitely got what they wanted out of it which is unfortunate but it's a lesson in you know no matter how much you think you know about the situation what you don't know is how much you know how you may have these blinders on right that you don't see the full picture because you want something to be real and true when it's not and so the takeaway message really is that you know you're human and you cannot no matter how much how high you go how far and how much you try to see ahead of time you cannot foresee everything and this is interesting for a fire sign uh fire energy or fire sign message because it talks about um you know mars is fire right it's the fire signs are motivation drive passion and all of that was in there you went in with all of those good highly motivated fire sign type qualities fire energy of you know wanting to get going and really you know really um make something happen for yourself in the material department like in terms of your goals and ambitions and so you got basically effed over by this person and it's really about in future asking yourself you know how when, when opportunities are presented to you you need to ask yourself how much do i really really want this to you know want this to be a certain way and is it actually that way am i seeing this correctly and all but also know that you are this is going to happen sometimes because it happens to all of us so you cannot uh, avoid every dishonest person every um you know every charlatan uh, etc some people are very convincing and i think this person was fairly convincing they made things look quite straightforward and you know you thought well i didn't i didn't see any reason not to do this but i you know when you went through the motions maybe you attended an event or when you finally got there you saw that things weren't as abundant as the person had promised you that there wasn't as much to be had and to be gained out of this situation as you had been promised okay and so don't beat yourself up and be too hard on yourself because this is inevitable if you're a human being and you're alive in the world interacting with other people right so that is the message for fire energy this month so if you're a fire sign watching if you are tapping into your fire energy you're trying to pursue a goal or find your um assertiveness find your drive uh find your autonomy to go for what you want don't let something like this stop you okay long term this is just a lesson along the way to tell you that sometimes everything that glitters is not gold right even when it, it was very convincing fool's gold though let's just put it that way with this situation so do not be too hard on yourself and going forward ask yourself how much of your heart and you know emotions are you bringing into a, a situation when you decide what opportunities to take okay so i will have the other uh, three sign readings available um this month as well so i hope you have a great rest of your month thank you for watching and take care